So I can try attacking this guy. If it really goes terrible, I can retreat, fully heal up, and then I can try attacking this guy, and I can even retreat one more time. And do the full rest up. So let's go ahead and uh, revive my defeated guardian. So we're gonna have my good friend back, my buddy, my pal. I'm gonna head down here. And I think we're gonna face that dragon. Okay. Righty ho. What's up, dude? That's a touch awkward. <laughs> It's all good. Um, they're more bunched up than last time, but you know, it's what it is. Uh, Soul Marins, yes. Okay. Pretty good. Deal two second damage, command main, three or less life. Right. Dead units get minus one, minus one. I don't really want to use that yet. Uh, because I don't have any undead units out except me. Let me guess. That is what I was guessing. Summoner, flying, knockback one, inflict freeze, deal four ice damage, two, and freeze units in a range three cone. Uh -huh. Ah, so even if I was going to lessen your attack, you'd still do that 4 freeze damage regardless. Right, so block, inflict, remove buffs, support, heal, 5, remove debuffs. So the reason I want to get rid of you is really just that you can heal folks. Um, I mean, I resist ice. Nope, vulnerable to fire. Don't resist ice, though. Do you resist ice? No. Hmm. Okay, uh, well. I don't want to be frozen, so I don't want to just go for a frontal attack there. Jeez. I think I gotta get out of his range. I can't get out of his range. I am simply in range. And that is too bad for me. Huh. How's about that? Okay, well then I gotta get out of this dude's range at least. Which I can go over here for. Uh, and she won't be able to attack me over there either. One has taunt in particular, so I guess that's what I'm gonna do. Uh, oh, can't see her, so I can't do it. I can do two ice damage to both of them. Doesn't feel entirely worthwhile, though. We can't see either of them. I'll just go for that guy while I can, I suppose. And is that my turn? You know what? Yeah, I think so. I think I'm going to do Plague. No, wait. I'll probably wait for him to summon a unit or two. Yeah. Next turn we'll see if I play the uh, skeleton captain or... Ugh, that's rude. Okay, he didn't summon anyone. range and over here and also this gets me like if this guy's attacked by the big boy that means no one else really can be which would be a positive uh, this is my way to not get backstabbed I would hope um, 
go. We can go over and start attacking her. I think I'll cast Plague as well. So everybody can chill a little bit. Okay, that's rude. You gotta stop that. Oh, went right for him. Interesting choice. I actually didn't really see that coming. Hmm. I have some interesting choices here. I think the Yeti's great, actually, for this. Um, hmm. Do I... Ooh. Well, okay, so here's, here's my thoughts. I can go over, attack this guy, and I'll cast one of his spells, which is always handy. Heal myself for the whole bit. Right. We all appreciate that. Um... Actually, as a question, this guy immune to freeze? I don't think he is. Oh. Oh. I think that means I, like, have to hit him with the ice giant, right? Like, if I can freeze him, that's big. Okay. Confirmed. Can freeze. Uh, I can then get all of my health back by attacking him. And cast one of his spells, which, I mean, all this just sounds pretty strong. How much can you heal people for? Heal five. Ugh. That's annoying. Because I can take the Scionist out this turn. If I attack her, I go bop, bop. Right. No more Scionist. Too bad. Um... Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, but I can't do both. Man, I feel like it's sort of. I feel like she's not really the, the big problem, though, right? Also, I feel like it's a mistake to not attack this man when I can. But also, if I attack this man for 5 damage, she's just going to heal him next turn. And that sucks. Uh, I think it's weird. But I gotta go for the kill. Yeah, yeah, I know. This also gives me a 2-2 skeleton that I can more or less do nothing with, but... Uh, let's see, block, but yeah, let's block, 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 block. Uh, yeah, one, two, three, oh, that's just how we can. So there's nowhere this guy can go that she can't just follow. And so... I guess I just leave him there? Meanwhile, I summon this yeti, or do I wait a turn? Summon the vampire lord. Oh, I think I do. Actually way to turn summon vampire lord because then I'll just get her 
may even want to send this man over here as bait for her to attack. Or this guy. Either way, uh, you know, I have to wait because I get... Oh, I gain three mana every turn. So I can do... Eh. Mm, nope, that's just not useful. Eh. I'd like to use it when it's a, it's a little bit more useful, but, you know, we'll see. Oh, there he goes. Armor 2. Not bad. I'm at five on this guy. Ah, love the love the artifact we got there. I don't love that. However, all right. So here's the deal. Attack her with that. Get rid of the block. Summon the vampire lord. You can do this. Get four more health. And now she is mind control. And as such, uh, okay. Heal five and remove debuffs. Uh, yeah. Wait, we can do that to ourselves. Or does he have the stun resistant status? I don't think so. So actually. Do it on this guy? So we can stun that dude. Ah, oh, terrific. Alright. Target enemy summoner cannot cast spells. That's rude. Oh. I'm sorry, was it only for that turn? I don't think I got that part. I did not, um... Alright. That's not great. Regardless, I'm gonna get some health back. Oh, okay. Yeah, enemy cleric. Well, sort of a waste, but also gotta do it because we can't have her healing people left and right. Oh, there we go. Yeah, you tried. Very nice. Oh, my vampire lord's uh, in that soup. As I said, that uh, that's unfortunate. Okay. Uh, let's see. Cannot attack this dude. Cannot attack this dude. I can attack this dude. That's not a good idea. Uh, oh, this guy can attack that dude if I move down. So I'll move, like... Uh, I don't know how I want to do it exactly. Let's... I'm going to try to set up my guys so that... They are effectively... hard to, like, line up with a range 3 cone attack, like he has. Um, let's also go ahead. We can buff up our skeletons some more. Ooh, and he can even come around the back. Get a nice diagonal stab on the guy. We love to see it. Okay. Hmm. That doesn't seem great. Okay, far shot attack. Yeah, yeah. Combo. Okay, pretty good combo.
Yeah, let's fly on over there. Get him with that. Um. There we go. Combo. Oh, well, I was hoping to combo a different way, but if you say so. I still move and attack? I sure can. Hmm. Go ahead and get this guy out. Mm -hmm. That's a good choice. Okay, you really don't like him, huh? Shoot. I... Wait a minute. Revive last control guy under your control again for, for only one turn? Is that how it works? I did not realize this is, uh, this is how this is going to work. Okay, that's... Uh, wait, no. Is that hitting all three of them? Oh. Well. What you gonna do? Be sad, I guess. Knock back one. Yeah. Oh. Huh. That was kind of odd how that worked out. Right, he's all frozen and stuff. Pretty, uh, pretty hard to deal with that. Alright. There we go. Don't mind if I do. I'll go, uh, well, first, I'll pop out a guy here. Then I'll walk over here. Um, you know what? He has four, three, uh, now he's gonna freeze people and make things annoying. Let's just get rid of that guy. All right. Hmm. And now... Let's see, he has a surprise going on, so let's find out what that is. Okay, it doesn't seem to be something to do with just attacking the guy. Oh, well good thing my guy's got block. That is pretty much why I did that. Always go for a good combo. Okay. Uh, yeah, you can attack there for three, which is not great. This is the only way I can get close enough to still attack this guy. I don't know that I need to play the Withered Butcher. Okay, that was sort of a weird move. Ooh, 
slow healer. That's, yeah, that's pretty annoying. Uh, that's 10. That's 14 damage, so it's plus 4. I mean... I think I've just got him. Uh, yep. And that's the game. Nice. Huh. What's happened to... Oh, I see. It was zooming in over here, but before it was quite ready. Uh, the next animal you summon gains loyal. Max hand size increased by one. Actually, I like that a lot. Let's go for that. Okay. Uh, let's use that right away so I don't forget about it. Not that I would forget to use artifact cards or satchel cards. That would be silly. Uh, okay, and with that, I guess we go into the portal. Whoop. Yeah, man. Get me out of here. Okay, Desert Dungeon Harvest. Uh, I feel like... I guess I'm going Desert, because I don't want to do Harvest or Dungeon, because... Yes, very good. Uh, because I'm going to be fighting probably like skeletons and undead in the dungeon. And then I'm going to be fighting like uh, mindless undead in the harvest. And so both of those are kind of like my own deck. You know? I don't want to do uh, mirror match stuff. Hello? I was like, wow, that's a shockingly empty tile. Uh, yeah, I'll do it, and then I will... Ah. <laughs> Got a rat again. Yeah, toodles. Alright. Well. Uh, no, we can still go north, so let's let's just do that. Let's clear this uh, upper area. Okay, good choice, me. I still got a key. So I got the Crest of Valor. Each of your combo attacks deals plus one damage. Okay. I mean, sure. Well. Okay. Very nice. Oh, hello. Shop? I assume. Um, deal six psychic damage to target enemy and three to you. Close an enemy in a magical cage, block sight and attacks till end of their turn. That sounds pretty cool. I guess this is specific to the mindless, uh, not just undead. Whereas another withered captain would be cool. However, I've already had enough uh, back and forth about my own deck that I don't think I need a. Yeah, I know. I. Try to hit the left arrow. Okay, all right. We're gonna use the mouse to move around. <laughs> nice job. Uh, hello. Yes, yeah, so this is pretty easy. Might be a little anticlimactic going this way. Guess that's how the cookie crumbles, though. I think I just end turn here. And there you have it. No follow. Mm-hmm. 
Okay, 60 gold, another die. You got. Oh, uh, I had a problem with her before. I don't think I lost her, but it was a tough fight. Uh, I'll allow animals get plus two, plus two, and she can summon these cat of nine. Revive until defeated eight times, right? Because of that. Um. Yeah, I guess we'll go for this fight. Um. I wonder if I can infect these cats with a different downfall. Although it looks like he can be backstabbed from over here. Mm hmm. So I'll just step right here to make sure that he cannot. Then we'll be ready to march in there. Uh, you're just gonna go... Well, how many people can attack you? Two. Five damage. Mm. I'm still just gonna go straight for the attack there. Mm -hmm. Lots of surprises, huh? See, now there's my question. Right. I'll stack it for three. That's, that's good enough. Let's go for this. Now, see, that is a question I had, is, uh... Alright, let's attack it like this, because the... Nope. This downfall does not overwrite the other downfall. Alright. Oops. No, no, we'll... Do... Yeah, we'll do that. That was all good. Uh, we are just gonna go with the plague. Turns out... This cat's just gonna keep coming back anyways. That's unfortunate. Um, but it's cool. I'll just attack her directly. Deal three damage, knock back three. Okay. Huh. Well, that's pretty good. Can't argue with that. Okay. Goodness, they all attacked over there because, uh, there we go. Guess I'm doubling my movement speed, which is irrelevant, but hey. Okay, that was a rude downfall. Oh my gosh, really? Are we gonna. Okay, thank you. I'll get this guy because he's new. We're sort of too late to uh, really affect how this battle's gonna go. Wow, we already got the boss key. Kind of funny. Okay. Uh, and yeah, I guess that'll wrap it up this time. We'll just peek at what's ahead. Um, okay, Sandstorm. Oh, nice. Sandstorm miraculously clears. Appreciate it, bud. What's this? Nothing, just a big ox statue in the desert. Got it. All right, so yeah, thanks for hanging out. Thanks for watching. Um, 
and I guess I will see you next time as we take on the desert. Toodles.